you never know when this stuff happens. It's not planned out. And that could happen like that. You could lose one of your best friends at the snap of a finger. Like, you just never know. We've been doing Shattered Dreams events across the city. It's very, very important for us to convey to these students that one action that they may take may end their lives or the lives of their friends. Imagining my best friend in that situation or being in that situation is extremely heartbreaking. I, I don't know how I'd process it. Having the children out here and actually seeing this in this type of a environment where it's an actual crash scene with blood and victims and faces that they recognize is very important for them to have because that way they put a face on it and they know that the actions that they take may end those lives as well as theirs. What they normally see is what's in the movies, what's on TV, what we see in the media, but they do not see it up close and personal. This makes it personal. My sister was actually in a car accident a year and a half ago, I think, and it looked like that. I just hope that, you know, distracting driving in general, texting and driving, drinking and driving, I hope people realize that it's a serious matter. It's just as bad as having a drink in your hand or having a drink before you get behind the wheel. It takes your eyes off of the road, it puts you in ri at risk and also those other drivers that are on the road. So when you get in your car, put that cell phone down, do not pick it up, do not text, it's not worth risking your life. It could be your best friend, your sister, your brother, your mom, your dad, you know. And I hope that people realize that this is something we really need to take on and attack the problem. I'm never gonna drink and drive, I'm not gonna text and drive again. Like, that's something that I will not do anymore because I don't wanna see my friends die.